Oh boy. On September 1st, our deputies went to an injured animal call and when they were going, they thought that they might have to put this animal down. But when they got there, what they ended up doing was much more heroic and brave. Take a look. Oh boy. I did, um, I did get a hold of somebody. Let's go check it out. Yeah. Huh. Easy, boy. Boy, Chad. It's okay, buddy. It's okay, boy. I got full serrated on this one. Okay. I was, he was able to let me get up and, and actually touch the white rope. I mean, it's... To make it worse, Chad, I think there's a beehive right here somewhere. Easy, boy. Easy. Easy. <laughs> Chad, there's one. Is that working? It's slowly working, Chad. Um, if I could just get the one more. I'm trying to keep him between me and the tree. I mean, keep the tree between me and him. I don't want to get beamed by that friggin' chunk of lumber. He's coming right at you, Mark. I know. Easy. Yeah, I'm good. Yeah. That ain't situation nobody has seen it. I'm good at it. You alright? You alright? Yeah, I'm good. Alright. Easy, buddy. I know we could have used a tranquilizer, but we didn't have fish and wildlife or game wardens available. And honestly, the deputies did a great job of using their tools or what they could borrow to cut this guy down so that he wasn't going to hurt himself or stay tied to that swing and end up dying out there. So outstanding job, gents. Thank you. Marty. <laughs> <laughs> yeah.